Wesley on Madison. A man from the shadows. A catastrophe in Point Pleasant, West Virginia. And now, on MetaZoo. Through all of this, Sam and Adam had maintained a locked gaze. And then, someone turned off the sun. No, that wasn't quite right. Although the effect was much the same. More than anything, more than all the chaos that had preceded that moment, the shadow cast upon the field and the thing casting it was enough for Sam and Adam to look up. It was a monster, and it had black wings, and piercing from this cold blackness two colder red eyes the same size of the sun they covered and just as bright. They searched the field and found Sam's eyes. And then, a white light. Sam was twelve years old and late for school. He jumped down the living room stairs two steps at a time, all in training to finally work up the courage to do three at a time. Maybe next week. A rabbit's foot keychain attached to Sam's backpack bounced alongside him. Adam was already at school and made a point of waking up at 5 a.m. in order to fit in some training of his own before first bell. Sam bolted through the kitchen, grabbing a misshapen pastry that M no doubt intended to be shaped like a cryptid, but might as well have been a duck. M was the man who had adopted both Sam and Adam after the events of the summer of 2021, and he was magic. Only hours after the veil shattered, the world descended into chaos. M appeared in the town from the northeast walking along U.S. Route 35 and seemingly without a care in the world. M stood nearly six feet five inches and was nothing but knots of wiry muscle, like an old tree branch that had weathered too many storms but was all the stronger for it. He was old, but the type of old that is hard to pinpoint, and his gray hair and age spots were fiercely contrasted by sharp blue eyes and unnaturally smooth skin. All the more reason why he looked ridiculous in an apron. <laughs> mm -hmm. well, Interesting. Hello, M. Yeah. Okay. Made of magic. Six foot five. So is this like a tall white? He's got gray hair, piercing blue eyes. I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to think of who M could be. I don't know that we have seen M in Cryptid Nation. Oh, no. In the samples, I don't think we've seen M. I don't even know who M could be. I have no, no concept. Should I bring that picture back up? Hold on a second. Also, Sam and Adam, they just met the Mothman. Yeah, they did. That definitely happened. I mean, in 2021, the summer, I don't know how much time has passed. I think Sam was eight years old in 2021. I believe this is four years later now. Uh huh. Because he's twelve. Yeah. When Sam and Adam were on the field and they were like cracking home runs and using their intuitions to like predict, you know, analyze and then like feel where the ball was going to be. Uh huh. That was when they were eight. So this is now. Uh, this is twenty twenty five. Okay. So now we are in the future, and the veil has been shattered for four years. Right. And uh, I don't know if they've had any encounters with cryptids, with the Mothman, with Indrid. We have no idea. But M has been caring for Sam and Adam, a man made of magic. Who definitely magic sounds man. like Charles White's Tall Whites, if you know, or Charles Hall, Charles Hall's Tall Whites, if you know what I mean. In my mind. You know what I mean? It could be. 